I think one of the coolest things about the Canon DSLRs is the Magic Lantern software that's available now. Um, and uh, here are some of the reasons why you might uh, why you might be interested in it. And uh, rather than talking through it, you can just pause it and check them out yourself. If you're interested, uh, follow along, and I'll show you how to install it. Okay. Alright, first you need to go to this website right here. Uh, I'll put that in the notes below. And uh, this is the main hub for all things Magic Lantern. Click on the download there. You can see it uh, starting to download quickly in my browser. And if you click show all, we'll see a zipped file of all the contents that we'll need to put on our SD cards. Just double click it, you open it, and you'll see everything there. The auto execute bin is the actual uh, main software that has to be on your car. That's like the most important thing. Um, but you'll see a lot of other stuff. Okay. Now place a fully charged Canon battery uh, into the camera without a battery grip. Just put it back on without the battery grip. Fire it up, and uh, as soon as it's all up and going. Click and go over to menu, and we have to format the card. So the first wrench, third thing down, do a low-level format. See, so, hey, now you have a clean card with a, a new format. Uh, the next thing that I'm not going to do right here is show you. If you go to a third wrench, you want to clear settings on the camera. Uh, I'm just not doing it right now because I did it on some other cards earlier, and uh, it will remove your picture styles. But do this one time, and you'll be good. Use just a standard SD card reader. You can't do this from the camera. So plug your card in. And you can see we've got the card plugged in, um, newly formatted. And all we have to do is select all the files that we downloaded from the site. Hit Command C to copy. And go over to the other window, Command V to paste. They all should sit on the root of the SD card. And once they're there, hit eject. Go back to your camera, switch it to manual. That's important to switch it to manual. Uh, open your slot, pop the new card in that has all those new files you, did, you downloaded. And fire it up. Okay, now to get Magic Lantern to install, all you need to do is hit menu, the third wrench over, firmware update. Click OK. And wait for just a second, you'll see a green screen here coming up and there it is success you did it uh, magic lantern is on your camera or it's running from your car on your camera um, to get it going you just turn the power off and then back on and now we're running magic lantern as you can see uh, pretty simple just takes a couple minutes to do um, you have to do it for each car uh, if we switch over here take the lens cap off you can quickly see by hitting the little trash can button the menu will come up and you can see all these wonderful new options that we have available. Thanks to Alex for making these cameras so much more powerful than they were uh, straight from Canon. Alright, later dudes.